Good morning, everybody. This is Susie B. Homemaker coming to you with the inspiration of breakfast. Today's topic is, that's not your job. See, we as humans, we like to control situations. We like to control our children. We want to control our mate. We want to control everything that's going on in our house. Sometimes we want to take it to where we want to control things at work. Or we want to control things at church. And that's not your job. That is not your job. Yes, you are supposed to, to have authority over the things that you have in your life. Yes, that what, what God gives you is yours. And you're supposed to take care of it. You're supposed to make sure that it, it stays afloat. But it's not your job to control things. Because there are certain things that you just can't control. And you really can't control people. You can't control places or things. You can try, but that's not your job. See, that's God's job. And who are we? We're, we definitely are not him. That's his job is to control and to mastermind everything. He's got everything under control. And see, when we realize that that's not our job, our life becomes less stressful, less demanding. When we put him first and trust in him and not our own selves, because that's not our job. See, we cannot make people do anything. That's a personal thing. You can't talk, walk around talking about people or trying to make them believe in what you believe in. It's a personal relationship. You cannot make a person be the way you are because don't nobody want to be you no matter what it is. That's not your job. They should want to be themselves. Because at the end of the day, all else fails. If they die, they're going to be who they are. And maybe you might not be going where they're going. So why should anybody want to be you? See, we try to control things too much. And it's just not our job. God loves you and I love you too. Peace and have a blessed day.